see that play by Jalen gets overturned. It could have been a two point game with 52 seconds to go. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's. That was a tough one, yeah. Um, good call on their part, you know, to um, challenge that. And then the one I missed before, too, we were down one. No, we were down three. I missed the kind of easy, easy hook shot. And then they scored on the other end. They were up five, I think, right away. So that uh, that one also kind of hurt. Uh, but yeah, plays, you know, towards the end that we could have, could have, could have, could have went a different way. How difficult is it trying to win games when you're shooting 20% on free points? Yeah, tonight we definitely didn't shoot the ball well from outside. They shot it a bit better, I think. Oh yeah, they shot it good, 41%. Um, we had some decent looks. Um, I felt like I rushed a couple. Um, I think we all just kind of were a little bit out of rhythm from from long range, but yeah, that that would have helped for sure. But it was pretty jarring the way you were playing down the, in, in the fourth quarter. You know, getting close to the central part of the offense, as compared to the last time you were in this building. Um, just wondering if that dawned on you at all, and, and it was something that you. Uh, just wondering if that what? It, it, I was just wondering if that dawned on you at all. If, what if does that, that mean, Don? Uh, like, did, did you just realize? Yeah, did you realize like just how funny it is? Yeah, funny? yeah, no, what a contrast, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah exactly, you know, so, exactly. um, but yeah, um, I'm I'm grateful for the support staff staff that we have around us. You know, the coaches and and everybody giving me confidence, and you know, I think I'm I'm I'm, I'm I'm being affected down there, you know, for, for not only scoring, but also uh, getting my teammates involved. Coach says you really stepped up late into the court and committed the ball and really were there for your team tonight. How would you describe your performance? Yeah, I would agree. I think with each game, I'm feeling more and more comfortable. Um, my teammates are finding me in those mismatches, and I'm trying to take advantage of them. Um, yeah, but as I said, I'm, I'm grateful for, for my teammates and, and for my, you know, for the coaches around me, obviously I put in a lot of work and try to find ways how I can be a better basketball player. But um, but I'm, I'm I'm grateful for for the support around me. What did you see out of out of Maxi today? How good was it having back? It was good. It was good to see him out there moving well. Um, I think he he didn't look out of out of rhythm. Um, yeah, we're we're. We're, we're happy to have him back, and you know now Luca. Hopefully, we can get him back as soon as possible. You know that will also be a big difference maker, obviously. So, um, hopefully, as soon as possible, we can all be back together and, and, and playing the playing the best basketball this season. What was your mindset there in the last three or four minutes when it was very clear that you were the guy and that the offense was going to flow through you and, and you were going to get those yeah. those, uh, those touches and push? Yeah, yeah, I felt. Honestly, I haven't felt like this for a while. Uh, last time I can remember, it was probably New York. Um, so I'm still getting in a rhythm, you know, and, and seeing how to just, just, I don't know, like without thinking, playing without thinking, you know. Almost, I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm not there yet, 100%. Um, but once I get there, I feel like that's when I'm really gonna uh, feel comfortable in every situation, see everything, you know, take my time on every shot, and everything will just fine tune and. And I think that's when uh, that's when I'll be even more effective. Okay, we'll do one in Spanish and then call it. Go ahead, Pedro. Thank you, Krista. Muy buenas noches. Buenas. Preguntarte, eh, has tenido protagonismo en estos últimos tres partidos. Sin embargo, los resultados no se han dado. Eh, ¿Qué tan frustrante es eso para ti, eh, considerando que han perdido los últimos tres partidos? Sí. A ver, los tres partidos han sido contra equipos de de alto nivel. Uh, Phoenix, que es uno de los mejores um, equipos de la liga, y ahora Clippers también, que están tienen un récord parecido al nuestro. Uh, estos partidos son muy apretados todos. Um, igual que hemos perdido los tres, hemos podido ganar los tres. ¿sabes? Ahí es una cuestión de, de ejecutar los detalles bien, um, hacer todo lo, todas las pequeñas cosas bien, y, y, y ahí al final pues es, es algo muy muy apretado y bueno no no estos tres partidos no nos han salido como queríamos pero vamos a seguir trabajando y a ver si encontramos eh, nuestro juego y, y, y ganamos el, el siguiente partido okay, thank you